Hi, I'm Christine. And I'm Michelle. And we're at Ride Amok. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hi. Today we're going to another church rummage sale because they are the best sales to shop. And actually today is Saturday that we're filming, so we're going on a half price day, so it's an even better deal. So come along with us as we shop these cheap prices. Come on. Hey guys, so this was my haul for $2.50. Um, I got this for 50 cents. I got a lot of sweaters and nice dress shirts that I can wear for work. And whatever doesn't fit me, I'm gonna go and get pieces. That was my dog barking. Um, and then Michelle found this really cute dress that is Anne, Anne T. 
retailer that she had the idea for my niece who was going into middle school that this could be a nice dress for like school things or dances so I'm really excited for that one and I'm just like this is gonna be really cute with leggings I got a dress for a formal event that I'm going to and I'm, I'm really happy with everything I got for 250 so here's my haul I got eclectic things I got the habit of buying picture frames that I like so that I'll find something later to put in it that way I have cute frames for all the stuff I find <laughs> I got a yoga block so now I have two nice yoga blocks I can do yoga good these child childhood memory core and memory core unlocked whatever the saying is I knew these existed I could not remember what they were called and now I can see them can never not buy Bernstein bears I love them and then I bought some funky, funny looking books, some antique vintage books. These paper, the ones with the paper covers are probably from the 1950s. I have a book obsession. I have a shelf of vintage, more vintage books. And I love graphic novels. Like, this is a cute story. I know I bought it before. This one was just funny. I had to get it. And then I got a, a nice bookend. And then for clothes, I was shopping cool threads or name brands. So I got a funky hat. This is a vintage sweater. I never heard of the brand. Coco Knits of California. It's just a cute, I just like the pattern. It's a nice vintage one. And then I also got a funny vintage sweater of flowers. And then otherwise those name brands, like I was saying. So this is Talbot. So this is a 2X. So it'll be baggy and nice because sizes are never what they are. Say they are in three sizes. So I don't look at sizes really when I shop used. I look at is this bigger or do you think it'll fit me? Sure. This is a nice Christopher Banks sweater. Can't go wrong with leggings with the pockets. Two nice exercise pants. This one still, this dress still has the, the tag on it. So it's a nice Nordstrom dress. It just looks, I don't know, I bought it because it's like a, I could visualize wearing it at the beach kind of, the walk on the mm. beach kind of dress. I could see that. Yeah, and then I got some Banana Republic pants. This, I love this shirt, it's super soft. It's Universal Thrive Good Co. Good Co. I think that's a more name brand. I don't, I don't know brands, but I know it's soft and it's cute. I got an Old Navy dress. I have bought similar cuts to this one before, so I know, I have similar cuts from Old Navy, so I know I'll, it'll fit, it'll be feel nice. I've bought different patterns like that before, so I know that's good. I got an Ann Taylor dress, an Ann Taylor shirt, another Ann Taylor shirt, a nice tank top that's soft, and I got some Lula Roll, however you say that horrible company's name. I just like the pattern on the sweater, and then it has I got a pink shirt that kind of matches it. That's the same brand. So, some nice baggy stuff to wear together. I think that's my haul. How much did you spend? Oh yeah, so it was like $3 and something. They couldn't really tell because it was like all the weird stuff that makes it hard to, to do because today was half price for everything other than clothes were a dollar. So I paid $1 for all the clothes and then two something for these, but I gave them $5 and said keep the change, so. $5 is a good haul for all these goodies.